What's going on guys? It's Dave from TwoAverageDudes.com. Still out in Nova Scotia, still loving it, although it is kind of cool today. So, you know, just watching the news and listening to the news in the last while, and I guess this trade war with uh, China and the United States is going on. There's $60 billion up in the air right now and trade embargo starting and Trump doesn't know if he's going to put a tariff on some stuff coming in from China and say a big mess. But you know what? Why isn't Justin Trudeau out trying to get China's business? Like, now picture back, when we had NAFTA, the problem with NAFTA, uh, Trudeau kind of screwed around a little bit. And what did Trump do? He shot over to Mexico and made the big deal and left Canada out in the cold. And we now we have a crappy deal that isn't worth the paper it's written on. So why doesn't Trudeau be a leader and do the same thing? He could he has nothing to lose. You know, he could go he could go start negotiating with him and say, hey, screw the United States, we'll do business with you. And maybe cut some good deals. But see, this shows what kind of a leader we have. The non-leader. So again, Canada's getting Trudeau'd. So don't you does anybody agree that we should be going over and trying to strike up a deal like Screw the United States, screw Trump. Let's let's go over and look after ourselves. And this way, this way, Trudeau can actually say, hey, you know what? Let's build a working establishment with each other and move forward and forget the past. What do you guys think? Mike, what's your take? Hey Dave, your idea is great, but it'll never fly. Why won't it fly? I'll tell you why. Because Justin Trudeau has burned all his bridges with China. So he can't quite go over there on his own and make his own deal because China hates us because they've been trudeau before. Justin Trudeau needs to step it up, apologize, do whatever he can to mend fences with China because it's a great opportunity now for us to go over there and like you said, strike a great trade deal. We can sneak under Donald Trump and really work a great deal for China. But Justin Trudeau can't do that. Justin Trudeau loves to apologize but only for things that are done in the past. Heaven forbid he apologize for something he's done. He'll apologize for stuff that's happened hundreds of years ago, and he'll actually pay for that stuff. But no, he won't apologize for his wrongdoing. And that's what he needs to do now. He needs to apologize to China, mend the fences, get over there and strike a great deal for all us Canadians. If he was a true leader, that's what he would do. You know, he'd pull up his socks, his big boy socks, well, you know, his have cartoons on them, so not really big boy socks. But he'd pull up his socks, suck it up, apologize to China, and work out the best deal possible to help Canadians going forward. Guys, post your comments below and let us know what you think. And check out our website, twoaveragedudes.com. Check out all our polls and surveys and all the good stuff. Catch you next time, guys.